Brace yourselves for the Brachiosaurus, learning friends. Paleontologist Elmer Riggs described some very unusual dinosaur fossils that were found in 1900. Whereas most dinosaurs had front legs that were shorter than their hind legs, this specimen had shorter hind legs. As a result, Riggs named the dinosaur Brachiosaurus, which means arm reptile. This giant weighed as much as 20 elephants. How tall was Brachiosaurus? Brachiosaurus was one of the tallest dinosaurs. If it held its neck upright, it would have stood at 13 meters tall. It may have reached a total of 28 meters in length and weighed an average of 50 tons. The legs of this dinosaur had to bear all the weight of the body while moving. We refer to such creatures as graviportal or heavy carrying just like an elephant. When did Brachiosaurus live? Brachiosaurus was alive during the late part of the Jurassic period, about 155 million years ago. Brachiosaurus bones were found in Tanzania, East Africa and in North America. It is also known that very similar animals lived at about the same time in both Eastern Asia and Africa. Did Brachiosaurus live in water? When Brachiosaurus was discovered, scientists thought that the leg bones were not strong enough to have carried the weight of the dinosaur. They thought that Brachiosaurus and other sauropods must have lived in water, which would have supported their weight. In addition, its nostrils were placed high on its forehead, so they could have been used a bit like a snorkel. While most scientists now agree that Brachiosaurus lived on land, there is evidence that they may have liked the water because their habitat featured low-lying plains bordered by an inland sea and crossed with rivers. Many remains have been found in areas that were once dominated by water. What did Brachiosaurus eat? How could a dinosaur with such a small head eat enough food to fill its huge stomach? A Brachiosaurus would need to eat 220 kilograms of food on a daily basis. Its nostrils are probably a clue. As they were placed high on the head, they would not interfere with the eating process, so it could munch almost continuously. It is thought that it used its long neck and high shoulders to reach up to the tops of trees. Its peg-like teeth were useless for chewing, so it swallowed stones along with its food, to break down the tough fiber of the plants and turn them to mush in its stomach. Fact File Brachiosaurus swallowed stones, which broke down the tough plant fibers into a digestible mushy soup. 